Hey guys, Zach from Say with Zach here. So, NHL Star Weekend is upon us. We are here. It is Friday, so that means the skills competition is today. Tomorrow is the All Star game. Uh, so, want to get into who they selected to be in each each uh, event and the winners from last year. Kind of fun little quick videos. We're gonna splice in three times. So, the two events on each board. So, four boards. And then we'll have the women's three on three players on the boards as well. That's the plan here. And then I will be head off to Cleveland tonight for the Monsters game. I will be trying to watch the skills competition on my phone while uh, we're doing all the Cleveland monster stuff, but we'll see how far that gets. Anyways, let's get into it. The fastest skater. So they, that is where they have the skater on the rink and they have to see who can finish the, the course the fastest. So. Last year, Connor McDavid won it at 13.37 seconds. So McDavid is the reigning champ. I think he's won a couple years in a row. I think Larkin won it the first year that the McDavid was in the league, and then I think it's been McDavid pretty much every year since. Uh, can't confirm that. That's just me guessing. But last year, McDavid did win. I double checked. It's right here in green, which I realize doesn't show up as well as I would like it to on the screen, but that's what it says. Uh, your, your competitors this year, Jack Eichel, Nathan McKinnon, Connor McDavid, so he could defend it. Matthew Barzell, Chris Kreider, Anthony Duclair, Travis Konechny, and Quinn Hughes. Those are your competitors for the fastest skater competition today. Then the next one is going to be the save streak. So that's where, again, players take shots and rotate through shooting at uh, goaltenders, and whoever makes the most saves wins the save streak. So last year, Henrik Lundqvist won it with 12 saves. Now, Henrik Lundqvist is obviously not in it this year, so there will be a new winner this year for this competition. Your competitors, David Riddick, Chris, uh, Tristan Jari, Jordan Bennington, Andre Vasilevsky, Frederick Anderson, Jacob Markstrom, Braden Holpe, and Kyle Hellebuck. So pretty much all your goaltenders are competing in this because that's their big competition. So all your goalies are pretty much in this one and are trying to beat 12 saves from Henrik Lundqvist last year. So those are the first two. We're going to transition into the next two. All right, so event number three. Here we go. So... You have the accuracy, shoot, accuracy shooting. So last year, David Pasternak did it in 11.3 seconds. He broke all five targets. I believe it's five. One, I think there's four corners and then there's one in the middle, if I remember correctly. Again, all-star games, the skills competition, I watch, but I don't you don't really remember much afterwards. I do remember watching it. I, I believe it's five. I'm pretty sure it's five. Uh, but yeah, Pasternak did break them all in 11.3 seconds. Very good, very skilled. He will not be participating in this one. He's doing a different competition this year. So we will have a new winner for this section. You got Jacob Slavin, Tyler Rutuzzi, Leon Drysaddle, Jonathan Huberdeau, Huberdeau, Nico Hishire, uh, Thomas Riddle, Alex Petrangelo, and Mark Shifley. So those are your, your three for this year. Or, sorry, that's your grouping for this year. Sorry. Uh, next up, we have the hardest shot, which is going to be, oh, one second. Sorry, cat wanted out of the room. Uh, he, he likes to come in, sit there for five minutes, and then leave, but he can't open the door even though it's cracked. It, it's a whole thing. Whopper is not the brightest crayon in the box. Anyways, hardest shot. Uh, last year, John Carlson did it uh, at 102.8 miles per hour. He is competing again this year, so we'll see if he can keep that winning streak alive. Mark Giordano, Seth Jones, Shea Weber, Victor Hedman, Elias Pedersen, and John Carlson are your competitors for this uh, this position, or this skill, this competition, whatever you want to call it. And then the new competition, the Shooting Stars. So, uh, yeah, this one they just shoot the net really hard and see if they can get it past a certain uh, miles per hour, per hour. I can't speak. Shooting star, new one this year. Uh, so this one, from what I've understood, is they're going to be sitting on platforms up in the top of the stands with a net over this crowd, and they're going to be shooting at targets on the ice. So from the top of the rink down to the bottom, they have to shoot into certain targets, and they get points based on which targets they hit. And whoever gets the most points wins. So it seems like it'd be kind of a cool event, especially if you're there. You kind of get to see the players shooting pucks over top of your head and stuff. That's kind of cool. But your, your competitors, David Pasternak, Matthew Kachuk, Patrick Kane, Tyler Sagan, Brady Kachuk, David Perron, Ryan O'Reilly, Mitch Marner, 
are your NHLers, and then you have two of the women's players going to be playing. So one for Team Canada, one for USA, uh, one from each team, and they're going to be voted on by social media. So you know, the social media, they're going to do some kind of voting event where we get to decide which one from Canada and which one from US, which women get to compete in the Shooting Star competition. So this one is, again, brand new this year. They didn't have this last year. So that's that's a big, uh, the new one they're trying out. So there's no shooting or like geeking or skills competition like that. They're doing Shooting Star instead. And then they are doing a three-on-three -three women's tournament as well. So with that, I'm just going to read the list. I'm not going to write it up on the board. It's a lot of names, but I'm going to read it out to you guys right here. So for Team USA, the women's team, is Casey Bellamy, Alex Carpenter, Kendall Collins Schofield, Brianna Decker, Amanda Kessel, Hillary Knight, uh, Jocelyn Lamirio, Lamirio, not sure, uh, Davidson, Annie Pankowski, uh, Alex Rigsby Calavini, Calavini, and Lee Stecker, Steckelson, Stecklin. Again, sure I misspelled, misread some of those names. I'm sorry. I don't, I'm not going to lie. I only have heard a few of these names. Unfortunately, I don't follow the uh, women's hockey as well, just because of the fact it's not as advertised here in the States. Um, I do know some, like again, Amanda Kessel, I know. I know Hillary Knight. I, I know a couple of them. Uh, Bellamy, I know her. Again, there's a couple I've heard from watching the uh, Winter Olympics a few years, but I don't know them as well as these guys. The Canadian All-Stars. Uh, you got Megan Agosta, Agosta um, Melody DeRusso, Anne Ray, uh, Renee De uh, Despian, Renata Fast, Laura Ferrento, Rebecca Johnston, Sarah Nurse, Marie Philip Pullen, I'm going to say Poland. Natalie Spooner and Bullery Turnbull. So, again, I could be saying all those wrong. Sorry if I did. But those are your USA uh, and Canada women's all star three on three tournament players. So, again, they're going to have a nice little round robin tournament for them, kind of helping promote the, the women's league. And because I know the women's league right now is trying to really push hard and get themselves a fair chance at having a fair league, which I would watch. If it was advertised and it was actually a round where I could watch it. I would be willing to watch it. Unfortunately, it's just not. So hopefully with the NHL help, maybe they can figure out something, they can get something going and make it good for women's league too. And I do know they mentioned something yesterday. I was watching some of the news that they are starting uh, the NHL in St. Louis. They are putting some, a couple, like I think some kind of million dollars worth of money into helping to build the women's hockey in St. Louis. So that's an awesome, awesome thing the NHL is helping with this year in St. Louis as well with the All-Star Game. So anyways, those are your skills competitions. Uh, again, I hope you guys enjoyed the videos. I'm looking forward to watching a little bit. Again, I'll, we'll be at the Cleveland Monsters game tonight, so I'll be watching mainly on my phone. I'll try and do a review video at the hotel room with the who won each skill competition. As best I can, I'll tell you guys how it went. Uh, but again, we'll be doing a lot of other stuff along with the All-Star game. So anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the All-Star Skills Competition. This is my favorite part of the NHL All-Stars, is the Skills Competition. The game is, it's there. It's not as much fun as the skills. But anyways, hope you guys enjoy it, and I will talk to you guys again later on tonight.